I want to spend a few minutes talking about the difference between work and kinetic energy and potential energy in physics. Because I personally was always very confused when I learned this stuff the first time, because when you learn about kinetic energy, the units are in joules. But the units of potential energy are also in joules. And the units of work are also in joules. All of these different things have the same units. What do they mean? What is the physical difference? Pretty early on in science, you'll learn that the concept of work is equal to force times distance, right? And so you might abbreviate that as work is equal to F dot D. But actually, that only applies if the force done on the object is constant. And as you push it, it moves through some distance D. But also wrapped up in this equation is that work is only done on an object in physics with X number of joules of work done if the force is in the same direction as the object moves through its displacement D. So you learn that work is force times distance, but pretty quickly you learn that that's not really the full picture. Because if the force is applied at some kind of angle, like if this were a rope pulling this block at some angle, the only force that counts in terms of work as it moves through a distance D is this component of the force, the component pushing horizontally. So F times the cosine of theta gives us that parallel force, F cosine theta, and then times the distance. So work is force times distance, but only amount of force that's in the direction of motion. Then we learn about different kinds of energy. Kinetic energy is the energy of motion, one half times the mass times the velocity squared. The faster something that has mass moves, the more kinetic energy it has. But the units of kinetic energy is joules, the same exact units we have for work. Then we learn about potential energy. For instance, in gravity, we raise something above the ground, h meters above the ground, it's said to have potential energy, mass times gravity times height, mgh, and the units of potential energy is also joules. So how is work related to kinetic energy and related to potential energy when all of them have the same units? What is the difference? Here is where the rubber meets the road. Work that's done on an object is equal to the change in the kinetic energy. If I'm doing work, I'm pushing on something. If I'm pushing on something through a distance, it must be accelerating. If it's increasing its speed, it must have more and more velocity and so more and more kinetic energy. So the more work done is exactly the same number of joules that go into the motion. And in a gravitational field, I can trade between potential and kinetic energy. So the amount of energy I have is the amount of change I can do in my environment. Positive work increases that budget. Negative work brings that budget down. So they have the same units. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.